Okay, today is fish day. Bought me some goldfish. Little boogers. Here they are. Sparkling in all their glory. Hopefully none of them get sucked up in the uh, <laughs> sucked up in the pump. I think there's a little snail in there too. How about that. You can see that down in the corner. Well, we're gonna turn them free here. Try to get this on film video. Don't know how well it's gonna work. <laughs> Here we go. I've been had them in here trying to get adjusted to the temperature for the last. Ah, right, we're gonna have. To... Okay, guys, you can see what's on the agenda today. We got fish. Twenty goldfish, approximately. I don't know how close she counted them. But I've had them in the water in this tank for uh, over an hour, getting adjusted to the temperature. I actually just let a little bit of water in to try to slowly get if the pH is any different. But anyway, I'm going to turn them loose. So here's the magic moment. There we go. Let the fishies loose. Okay. There they go, all to the bottom. And then there was a snail in there. They'll probably get sucked up in the filter. <laughs> Who knows? They're down in there. I'm going to feed them here a little bit. And we'll see how things go. Hopefully they survive. That's all for now. Yeah, I put some food in there. I'm going to cut back the spray bar to kind of give you a better picture. Goldfish down there. Moving all over the place. Hopefully they'll make it. They're eating, looks like they're eating the food that's fallen. So that's good. Looks like there's a few bugs in here too. So I think they'll be happy. I guess they just have to get used to the agitation from the uh, spray bar too. Because when I had the spray bar on, it seemed to kind of be all kind of schooled up in one corner but they'll get used to it. So we have fish. We'll see how things go. Hopefully it doesn't get too cold. You can also see I put some uh, slate, pieces of red slate and some rocks that I had from when I had aquariums in the past. Kind of put them up around the pump hopefully to keep the uh, fish from getting sucked up in there. I don't know, it might happen. I'm thinking about building some kind of netted cage or something to slip the filter down in, or the pump. I think that might be a good idea. Anyway, I'm going to turn things back on here and let the fish do their thing. give you an update in a few days and let you know how the fish are doing.